uh, but I have to say this is not the perfect jacket of all time and today I want to share with you my personal review on the Knox Urban Pro MK2 alright so this video is an honest feedback or what I've experienced with the jacket uh, take note I am not being paid or sponsored in any way by Knox to give this review um, just want to actually share with you my experience with it the jacket was bought from Planet Knox originally for about 1,400 ringgits uh, all the way from UK including taxes and duties the purpose of the Knox I bought uh, was to be used for my daily commute to and back from work now on sizing I'm typically wearing a size 33 34 jeans my chest is about 39 inches uh, in diameter and the Knox jacket I'm wearing now it's as you can see in the in, in, in the in the video and the photos that I'm posting up now it's a size medium so the size medium as you can see is very form fitting very tight fitting around your body the Urban Pro MK2 build quality is one of the best I've seen so far from any manufacturer or brands out there. It is made out of uh, this high tendency stretch nylon material, uh, arrow mesh materials for better abrasion, cut and tear resistance as well. And, and the jacket comes with elbow and shoulder and back uh, protectors armor and one benefit of this armor is actually it's a very soft type of armor it's called Knox Microlock armor from 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 Knox themselves and I must say it's very comfortable when you wear uh, compared to the other hard type of armor uh, within any any jackets now the jacket also comes with pants to jacket connectors uh, in the form of securing your belt uh, to the jacket you have this uh, belt loop uh, so that uh, the knocks will be secured to your jeans uh, and pants the jacket also comes with four pockets one on the chest two inside and one at the back of the jacket itself uh, this one with the zipper inside has no zipper outside all her zippers now when it comes to um, safety certification uh, for the Knox the Knox uh, Urban Pro MK2 is now certified as an AA government now what do I like about this jacket well guys first thing of all I have to admit I love how it looks first and foremost now the Knox jacket is an armored jacket in which I would wear um, all the time when it comes to actually riding the bike because it's just how it looks on 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 on, on the rider I would say all right so part of the reason of this is because uh, as you can see that the jacket itself it is not a loud type of design jacket it doesn't scream that look at me I'm a biker uh, and also the design of the jacket is very uh, uniform to each other I mean look at how the combination of the high tendency stretch nylons uh, in relation to the aero mesh de uh, design on it and at the back as well you can see the combination between the design of the stretch materials and the aero mesh makes the jacket looks very class, class and very unique as well gives you that feel that Batman would actually wear this jacket and at the same time uh, one thing I like about the jacket is the uh, armor on, on, on the jacket it doesn't intrude your, your riding and doesn't actually gives you that, that that hard feeling in your elbows or your shoulders or even your back because it's actually one of the most comfortable um, armor on a jacket that you can have currently because it's very soft and it conforms to your body and just moves around easily as well and uh, one good thing about the Knox it also comes with a connector for your chest protector if you choose to 
upgrade your your production up front down here. Knox also sells this as an option uh, for if you want to actually beef up your jacket, especially for those of you who likes to ride canyon, right, and uh, your twisties, uh, so that you know you actually are more protected. Now, so that's one that's the favorite things that that I like about the jacket now. Uh, but I have to say this is not the perfect jacket of all times. Alright guys, now here are the things that I do not like about the Knox Urban Pro MK2. Now, first and foremost, the jacket is advertised as a hot summer riding jacket. And the perception of it is, oh it's going to you know, flow a tremendous amount of air. Oh, it's going to be very comfortable when I'm actually in traffic or riding during summer. Um, so, um, it, for me, so far I've been riding with this jacket for the last two months. And I will say that I uh, report to you guys the lesson learned uh, from riding this jacket uh, because I ride to work and back. And I noticed that I do sweat in this jacket um, when it comes to, you know, the normal stop and go traffic, filtering uh, uh, between cars to go to work. Does it flow air? Does it, you know, uh, keeps you cool? Well guys, just to give you some explanation, as you can see, the mesh of the jacket is mainly located in the front portion of the jacket. You can see here, right? So the front part of the jacket, there is mesh. But when it comes to at the side, you can see from here and from here, the mesh itself is actually, um, how do you say, um, being replaced by the high tendency stretch nylon material. I would say this is actually for abrasion protection. So not only that, at the back here as well, the mesh is also covered by another layer of uh, fabric for also for protection, I, I, would, I would think. And at the back, as you can see, there is no the you can see the, the that 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 holes from the mesh is is is, is no longer there because of the additional um, how you say uh, fabrics that that's located at the back of the jacket. Not only that, uh, I think that the reason why the jacket is hot as well is because to enable Knox to get the double A certification as well. They actually had to cover the the back with uh, protection, um, the back protector as as uh, as a, how you say to protect you while you're riding. And just want to show you something when it comes to the back protector. Now the protect protector, even though it's soft and whatnot, but the thing is, I just want to show you to how big is the back protector. It's really humongous when it comes to a back protector. This is actually a, 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 the biggest big back protector I've seen in any jacket. Just as a comparison, yeah. This is actually a back protector where usually the size back protector that you use for my other jackets. As you can see, it is still a very big back protector for 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 uh, for, for the jacket. But don't get me wrong. I mean, it's good for protection, but just give you some reference to size. Right, so that's a uh, back protector for a normal insert jacket. Now, I'll give you a comparison for another back protector that is actually usually when you use a standalone back protector for the track, a full back protector. As you can see from this force field uh, body armor, this is actually the Pro uh, L2K Evo. As you can see, the size of the full length back protector that you, you normally use for track. It is more or less the same size as the Knox inserts, as you can see. Uh, right, so I think the coverage for the Knox insert is actually more than the force field, as you can see. So this also plays a role when it comes to you know the the the. Um, heat management of, of, of the jacket by itself. One thing I realized uh, the, why there's a few hot spots within this jacket is because you know the jacket is um, form for, forming to your body, it's very tight. 
it's a tight fitting kind of uh, design to it because the purpose of the jacket is actually also used as an undergarment, an uh, under armor under layer. So what happens now here is the the, the jacket actually um, conforms to your body, so it also restricts the air movement around the jacket because your your your, your body is very tightly uh, against the jacket. So. If you guys want to use the Urban Pro MK2 for your uh, normal commutes in the tropical weather, um, especially if you are staying in a country where your summers or your your uh, your weather, your temperature is anywhere from 30 to 40 Celsius. I would really recommend you to size up one size so that you have space for air to move around the, the, the jacket. If you are having summers anywhere from um, 22 Celsius to 30 Celsius, this jacket is actually perfect for you to go around doing your blasting or even your day-to-day -day commute because it's you will not get that, that, that heat that, that hot spot that I was I was mentioning about at, 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 at the back bottom back or even under your arms all right guys so that's the review and uh, personal back of the um, Knox Urban Pro MK2 if you like this video please do like and subscribe to my channel to see more of this kind of content moving forward please stay safe and ride safe and I'll see you again soon all right all right see you